Hello guys, my name is Precious and welcome to Daydreams. So before we start today's video, I want you to do me a favor by subscribing to my channel and if you subscribe, don't forget to turn on the notification to be able to watch my next video. So in today's video, we will be talking about top pro tips that will surely improve your game on Fortnite Battle Royale. I'm sure you will enjoy this video. Coming in at number 4 we have an amazing new way to travel around the map, and that's with the new freeze traps. Now we didn't know how we'd feel about these traps at first because it seems like they aren't too versatile, but there is one thing that they're extremely good for, and that's definitely mobility. Unlike bouncers and launch pads, these traps are common so you find them everywhere. You can travel insane distances at very fast speeds without ever feeling like you're wasting something valuable. The best way that we've found to use them is to build a few ramps up, rotate your ramps backwards, and then slide down with turbo build. This gives you some amazing speed and allows you to travel super fast without wasting any rare mobility items. Coming in at number 3 we have using a super launch pad with a port of fortress. Now we all know that bounce pads were removed from Fortnite and one of their best uses was the super launch pad. They allowed for crazy mobility around the map and now that bouncers are gone we can no longer use them. Luckily port of fortresses are still in the game and you'll usually find them set up around the map empty. If you build up to the side of the fortress you can still utilize the bouncer attached to it to create a super launch pad. Now you won't be able to do this every game, but it's definitely a good thing to know and remember when you come across them. Coming in at number 2 we have an awesome new way to phase through someone's builds to counter turtling. Now we learned this technique from Martaz, but the original creator is the real Rel over on the competitive Fortnite subreddit. Both of these guys are awesome creators and both their links will be in the description below, so make sure you guys go and show them some love. Now to do this, you'll have to wait until someone turtles up. When you try to break through their pyramid on top, you'll find the turbo build is just too fast to replace the pyramid with your own. So to counter this, build two walls around their pyramid and then stand in the corner when breaking through it. This will phase you through their pyramid and allow you to break right through the floor for an easy kill. Most people won't know that you phase through their pyramid, so they'll still be holding turbo build down on their pyramid and not their floor. Now this technique does take some practice, but it's super strong in game. Just make sure you watch for traps when doing this. Finally, coming in at number 1, it's our new favorite way to travel across the map in Season 6. Now we all know the new floating island acts as a permanent launch pad, allowing you to rotate across the map, but there's a way to give yourself an extra boost to go twice as far. To do this, simply build a ramp off the side of the island, now shoot the cube, and then drop off the ramp into the air. If you do this correctly, the cube will shock you while floating and send you really high into the air with your glider out. This method is super good when going for high kill games and wanting fast rotations. Anyway guys, it's gonna go ahead and wrap it up for this video. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure you hit that thumbs up button down below. If you're brand new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to never miss a 